after adding the phantom camera add-on to our project, like we did in the previous video, we add a phantom camera and a phantom camera host. We customize our timers and duration, and on follow mode we do frames and assign to the player. Then we create a new script on camera 2D and create a new on ready variable for our phantom camera. After that we create another variable for the magnitude that will be how strong the shake will be. Then another two variables, one for is shaking and another for can shake, both false. And a last one for the shake amount. That will be a vector 2.0. Then we call the function process. We verify if we pressed any button for debugging purpose and change the is shaking to true. Then we verify if isn't shaking we return and if it's shaking we put a new value to the shake amount and do pc.globalPosition plus equals shake amount. If can shake can shake equals true timer dot start uh, okay add hands there on the hand def and we connect the timer signal timeout to our camera script and put both variables at false and now you can test it I think no activate one shot and you can test it. 